praying is asking and receiving. Ah, this is Harold Smith. And this is a continuation of a series of teaching I did on the Sermon on the Mount. And the theme was learning how to live my life as Jesus would live my life if he were I. And uh, this uh, section is uh, we're talking about uh, pray, prayer and praying. And if you get nothing else out of this brief video, I want you to get this message that prayer is asking and receiving. In the Sermon on the Mount, uh, in chapter 7, Jesus said, Ask, and it shall be given you. Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened unto you. For everyone that asketh receiveth, and he that seeketh findeth, and to him that knocketh it shall be open. Prayer is asking and receiving. Jesus goes on to explain that, you know, what earthly father, if the son asked for bread, would give him a stone. And, uh, uh, you know, we as uh, parents, we love our children. We want to give good things for our children. And how much more does our heavenly father want to give us uh, what we need, what we ask for? And so prayer is asking and receiving. In fact, most of the promises about prayer is all about asking. In John 14, uh, 13 and 14, And whatsoever you shall ask in my name, that will I do, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. If ye shall ask anything in my name, I will do it. John 15, 7. If you abide in me and my word abide in you, you shall ask what you will and it shall be done unto you. Uh, John 16, 24. Here the four. Have you asked nothing in my name? Ask and you shall receive that your joy may be full. Praying is asking and receiving. I want you to get that message. Prayer is asking in Mark 21, 22. And, and all things, whatsoever you shall ask in prayer, believing, you shall receive. Now, perhaps you say, well, I don't know what to pray for. I don't know how to ask. I'm not good at asking. Uh, I don't know how to ask. Just keep praying. And ask it, and God will teach you, and God will teach you what to pray for and what to ask for. And Mark uh, eleven twenty four. Therefore I say unto you, what things soever you desire, when you pray, believe that you receive them, and you shall have them. And... Uh, the disciples came to Jesus and said, Jesus, teach us how to pray. And, of course, we uh, know the answer was that uh, uh, Jesus gave them the Lord's Prayer. Uh, the more appropriate name for this would have been uh, the disciples' prayer. And Jesus taught them how to pray. And if you notice, if you go through what we know as the Lord's Prayer, it's all about asking. Number one, ask that his kingdom come upon this earth as it is in heaven. Number two, ask for our daily breads. Ask for our daily needs. God wants us to ask him. Number three, when we pray, ask for forgiveness. Ask that we're able to forgive others. Pray for our own forgiveness. It's asking. And number four, we're asking also for God to protect us from the evil one. Praying is asking and receiving. I hope this will end.
empower you and give you confidence to go before the throne of God and ask him what you need. And God is faithful. Have a good day.